Hi, everybody. Welcome to our next chapter in Introduction to Business, which is Chapter 7. And the title of this chapter is Business Management. In this video, I will be going over the key terms for Chapter 7. So we're going to start off with Section 1 and take a look at Management Functions. All right, so management includes the processes or functions of planning, organizing, leading, and controlling. Planning is the act or process of creating goals and objectives as well as the strategies to meet them. Organizing is getting the resources arranged in an orderly and functional way to accomplish goals and objectives. An organizational chart shows how the firm is structured and who is in charge of whom. A top-level manager is responsible for setting goals and planning for the future as well as leading and controlling the work of others. A middle manager carries out the decisions of top management. An operational manager is responsible for the daily operations of a business. Leading means providing direction and vision. And Controlling the operation means keeping the company on track and making sure that goals are met. Okay, now we're going to be moving on to Section 2, which is about management structures. Okay, so a line authority is an organizational structure in which managers on one level are in charge of those beneath them. A line and staff authority is an organizational chart that shows the direct line of authority as well as the staff who advise the line personnel. A centralized organization puts authority in one place with top management. A decentralized organization gives authority to a number of different managers. Departmentalization divides responsibility among specific units or departments. And an entry-level job is a beginner-level position. All right, so those are the key terms for Chapter 7. Thanks for watching this video, and I hope you have a great day.